Hi everyone, Yvonne Blasquez here. Um, I'm going to make my current way of how I eat raw garlic. Um, my original video, which has a lot of views, is is um, that was my original recipe. And it's still an effective recipe, but a couple of new changes that I made in this video um, is I've eliminated the olive oil because it's really it's you don't really need it, and I still use the hummus from Whole Foods. It's just the best hummus. Um, around and the hummus from Whole Foods if you can look right here it already has olive oil so I mean adding the olive oil to me was just I mean if if, if a person really likes uh, adding that extra olive oil you know kinda a little more a little more I guess you call it a, a Mediterranean kind of a of a feel then so be it um, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I um, how I do this from scratch. So let me go ahead and uh, take this bulb off here. Okay, so I'll show you guys. All right, so here's the garlic clove. I'm not going to do it on the plate. I do it here on the cutting board. And what I do is I just take the peel. I don't know there's faster ways to do this, but this is how I do it. Once you hear that that snap, that pop, I just like to cut it down the middle. And if it's a real big clove like this. I make a decision. Either I eat the, uh, half of it or the whole thing, because um, garlic's a very potent. Um, I guess you can classify it as a herb, uh, or really, it's a vegetable. It's an allium vegetable. It's in the allium family. So I just like to cut it in slices like this. And the reason why I do this is because um, I, I believe that the, the reason why it's better to cut it raw. And, and, and like this, I mean, obviously you can probably use a garlic press and all that, this and that and the other thing, but I just like doing it from hand. That's just me, you know. I, I I like the whole idea of being able to be a part of the 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 natural the chemical reaction that activates uh, the it, there's a catalyzation. It's a chemical reaction where the allen uh, is. Um, is catalyzed by the enzyme allanase and it forms allicin, which is the potent uh, compound that's or one of the potent one one of one of the main compounds in garlic that gives it many of its health benefits. But um, there are many other compounds as well. But when you cut it in small little pieces like this, you increase the surface area, and so the things that are actually going to help to catalyze this reaction are going to be mainly oxygen or air. So, uh, but there's kind of like a, um, a window of opportunity. I believe it's the first five to ten minutes you kind of maximize that reaction, but after that it actually starts to degrade. So, um, it's kind of like strike while it's hot. And so, what I'll do is um, once I'm finished cutting it uh, thin enough, or you know, when I'm just, I've had enough of slicing it, I've done it good enough, it's adequate. What I do is um, I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands because the garlic oil gets on my hands and I don't want to get it over anything else. So let me go do that. I'll be back. So I'm back. So all I do now is with the raw garlic, I just scrape it off and put it in this plate. All right. Now let me show you what else we do. So all I do is I take the hummus right there. And if you want to watch calories, again, I mean, to me, this is a platform to consume garlic raw. I get, I've, I got a lot of comments on the video about people talking about, you know, man up and, you know, just take raw garlic down with water. I just think that's really silly, though, because um, the reality is, why would you want to, like, do it like that? It, 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 you know, this way, it's completely pain-free and, and, and there's no discomfort at all doing it this way. All right, so the first spice is turmeric, potent anti-inflammatory. I don't put a lot in there, just a decent amount. Now, one of you guys, commenters, told me about black pepper. It increases the bioavailability of turmeric, amongst other. It also increases the bioavailability of just about everything else. Plus, also red black pepper is a natural thermogenic. And even red, even as as a natural, um, it's also been. I think it's a natural t testosterone booster too. So, who knew, right? Okay, here's sumac, my other 
This is, my, this is really the key spice in my opinion. This really kind of makes this thing really a nice Mediterranean vibe and it's a super spice actually. I think I recall on uh, some websites say it was the highest antioxidant spice. This is something new folks. Um, this is kelp. Being that being as that I'm a vegan, um, iodine is a, is a, is a, is a um, important um, nutrient that, uh, or a nutrient or a mineral for that matter, that uh, to, that vegans can be deficient in. And if you look here, this has nine nine hundred seventy percent. So um, I just put a little bit of this. And all it is is kelp. It's just it's seaweed granules. Okay, you don't you don't need to put a lot, and that's it. So the last two ingredients is going to be pumpkin seeds. I love pumpkin seeds. So just sprinkle the top with pumpkin seeds. There you go. And then a new addition. There's recent research. If you look at the bottom of this video, you'll see the studies. But there's been studies that show that selenium um, is a powerful, potent synergist to the compounds in garlic. So when you eat this raw garlic with some selenium, which is actually from Brazil nuts. Brazil nuts are the the um, richest natural source of selenium. And selenium is a um, it, it, it's it's an important mineral in uh, I believe an antioxidant pathway. I want to say let me see which one was it. I think it's uh, I forget which one it is. I'll have to look at oh I think it's I think it has to do with uh, the gluta. Let me think about that. So I was, it was on the tip of my tongue, glutathione. Um, selenium plays a role in um, in the um, production of glutathione in the body. So anyhow, um, this is my new recipe, and um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just take a bite here. You guys can see it. I usually would put more pumpkin seeds than this, but uh, and I probably will actually. This is amazing. You guys got to try this. Every ingredient I just put in here, you need to try it. Look at the studies at the bottom of this video, specifically the ones on selenium and its interaction with garlic. It's like a potent, uh, it, this is a step up from my original raw garlic. Um, how do you raw garlic? So hopefully you will um, benefit from this video. Um, as you can see, I've, I've benefited from this because it's, it's natural food from the earth. It's it's no kind of gimmick or scam. I mean, garlic's been known to be a healthful vegetable for centuries. It's in the alien family, the same as onions. So um, you know, do your research. Check out the check out the evidence, um, the scientific evidence. Okay, on it, and uh, and that's it. So here, this is just a simple way to enjoy um, raw. And uh, thanks for watching. Tune in next time.